Welcome all of you. Hope you are doing well. We have to solve for x in this question if x factorial is equal to x cube minus x. So let's get started and see its solution. Let's rewrite x factorial as x times x minus 1 times x minus 2 factorial. Like 6 factorial is equal to 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 times 2, 1. But we can rewrite it as 6 times 5 times 4 factorial. In the same way we have done for x factorial. And on the right hand side we will take x as common. We are left with x square minus 1 inside the bracket. Now we will change this. x minus 1, x minus 2 factorial is equal to this can be written as x minus 1 times x plus 1 this is an identity now this and this will be cancel out x and x cancel out we are left with x minus 2 factorial is equal to x plus 1 let's name this equation as equation 1 in the next step we are going to suppose x minus 2 as x minus 2 is equal to y so x plus 1 will be to make it x plus 1 we are going to add 3 on both side it will be equal to x plus 1 equal to y plus 3 now name this equation as equation 2 and this as equation 3 by putting the value of equation 2 and equation 3 in equation 1 we can see x minus 2 is equal to y, y factorial and x plus 1 is equal to y plus 3. Now this y factorial as it is, this will be subtracted here is equal to 3. Now this can be written as y times y minus 1 factorial minus y is equal to 3. We can see y is common here, so y minus 1 factorial minus 1 is equal to 3. Now y minus 1 factorial minus 1 and this y will be taken here on the right hand side and it will be divided. y minus 1 factorial. Now this 1 will be taken on the right side and it will be added. y minus 1 factorial is equal to 3 over y plus 1. At this step you have to watch it very carefully as uh, negative of factorial is not possible. So y cannot be equal to 0 but it would be greater than or equal to 1. So by taking y is equal to 1 we can see 1 minus 1 0 factorial is equal to 3 over 1 plus 1 means 0 factorial is equal to 4 not true. Now putting y is equal to 2. 2 minus 1, 1 factorial is equal to 3 over 2 plus 1 is equal to 5 over 2 which is also not true. 1 factorial is equal to 5 over 2 not true. y is equal to 3 means 3 minus 1, 2 factorial and uh, on the right side 3 over 2, 1, 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. Now 2 is equal to 2, this is true value of y y is equal to 3 now putting this value of y is equal to 3 in any of these two equation but we are going to put this in equation 2 putting y is equal to 2 in equation 2 equation 2 is x minus 2 is equal to y x minus 2 is equal to y is equal to 3 now we will take this 2 on right hand side so x is equal to 5 is the required answer. From the value of y, we got the value of x is equal to 5. Let's check that we got the correct value of x or not. We are going to put this in original equation. Original equation is x factorial is equal to x cube minus x. Now x is 5 here. So 5 factorial is equal to 5 cube x is 5 cube minus 5 uh, now 5, 5 5 factorial is equal to 5 times 4 times 3 times 2 times 1 and 5 cube is equal to 5 
times 5 times 5 minus 5. This is equal to 120 and this is equal to 5 cube is equal to 125 minus 5. 120 is equal to here is it's also equal to 120. As left hand side and right hand sides are equal, it means x is equal to 5 is the correct answer. I hope all the steps are clear. If you have any query, write in the comment box. Practice more and more to be perfect. Thanks for watching.